The health rankings have been released per county, and Nye County came in 16 out of 16. We're going to speak to Dr. Eric here at Healthcare Partners about how we may be able to do better. This was a study done by a reputable uh, think tank that uh, looks at health data and statistics, mm -hmm. telephone survey along with data that come from places like highway patrol, hospitals, mm -hmm. and they tried to paint a picture of what is the health of the United States county by county. They looked at every county in the United States. Unfortunately, each of the last four years, Nye County has slipped in these rankings mm -hmm. such that now uh, we occupy 16th or last place in Nevada overall. There's two different criteria in these rankings. Uh, one is health outcomes, which just looks at things like how many life years are lost, which is calculated by looking at, well, what's the ideal life expectancy in the U.S.? And compared to that, when did people actually die? Mm -hmm. So life years lost is a sort of a standard number mm -hmm. medical statisticians look at mm -hmm. to look at the health of a community. Uh, that's in the category of health outcomes. Mm -hmm. Things like birth weight, mm -hmm. you can't control that. It's just a statistic that comes the day you're born mm -hmm. and has a profound influence on your long-term health. So health outcomes is one. Mm -hmm. Health behaviors occupied a far larger part of that mm -hmm. survey. And to me, the optimism in that survey comes from there. Behaviors can be modified, right? Mm -hmm. uh, so in that regard, uh, things that were looked at were things like sedentary lifestyle, activity level, diet, uh, access to health care, mm -hmm. educational level, uh, income level. So many of these things are modifiable, uh, mm -hmm. some earlier in life, some as we go along in life, and all have an impact on our health as we go through life. Would you recommend that the public take a look at these statistics and see what things apply to them and perhaps they can alter to give them a better outcome personally? No, I think so. I, I think the data is very easy to look at. All the parameters are laid out and you can see from there where are the areas for improvement both individually and as a group, as a community. Does having access to health care like uh, health care partners here play a factor in this? I think that's a huge factor. I mean, we've known for decades that people with easier access to doctors, more uh, convenient access, better priced access, mm -hmm. end up being healthier people. Mm -hmm. The things we need to stay healthy as we're adults often involve testing, medications, follow-up, medical professional advice. When those things are made available to people, that population is healthier. For more information, you can go on the web to countyhealthrankings.org. This is Deanne O'Donnell for News 46.